here, you guys. Hi, y'all. Hey there, folks. Welcome back to a new episode of Talking with the Pure Peoples. We're back at it with Season 2, Episode 9. Oh, yeah, we're back at it, finally. Before we get started with today's episode, why don't we share some updates as what's going on new with the Pure Peoples and new with Tiver Studios itself. Well, as you guys have already know, we do have a new TV show on Jay's Casting Comedy, The Pure Peoples Perfect Adventures. You can watch full episodes right now there. Yes, we finally have our own TV show, and if you guys love it, let us know. Yeah, if it was worth watching, or was this was this something you guys been waiting for after the two movies? Is this something you're going to want to be able to lead up to until our third movie comes out? You let us know. Now, why don't we get started with today's comment. The first one is from Creamy Ivan. Pure peoples, my new year is coming out so good so far. We're so happy to hear that from you, Creamy. Yes, our new year is coming out pretty good, too. You're like, yeah, we're already in April. Like, we came from January to April. This year is coming out good so far. Yep, we're already in spring. Uh, spring is my favorite. I love the spring flowers. And it's right next to summer. Why do you think I love spring more? It's right next to summer. That just sounds like you love summer more. Yes, I love summer more, but spring is still awesome. Well, spring is just like summer. We got sunny days, nice flowers, fresh air. Same thing. Yeah, but you don't really get to go to the beach. Oh, no, you got to go to a hot, hot day. You're better off waiting until summer for the beach. You're right, but... I'm so am going good for this year. Like, we already got new anticipated good movies coming out. Oh, yeah, this year is going to be lit. But next year should have some big lit movies, too. Hey, every year there's always going to be a good movie. You got to learn to just stay up and update it. Connie Icky Bill wants to know, is Beanie all right? Beanie is all right. Yes, our little human girl, she's doing all right. Yeah, she's still in Human Village, enjoying herself. And if you've seen our show, you can definitely know she's did a couple of appearances in the show. Oh, yeah, she's like, she's still a character. She's still a character. And she's been visiting our village nonstop. She loves us. We're her best friends. And she's our best friend. Exactly. That's why we know that Beanie is always going to be playing with us because she's our best friend and she comes to visit our our village probably the only human in our village that really comes around right like we still stuck on pure peoples right but if other humans wanted to visit our visit our village it would be so much fun right like we can't just get beanie to get all the respect in pure in pure people village right we need to get more humans to our village yes but hopefully we can add some stuff like that to our third movie exactly rampage mata wants to know hey lena questions if you have a mom where's your dad my dad do i have a daddy my mom never really told me about my daddy. Do you even have a dad, Lena? I don't know, guys. My mom never told me. Well, then, it was just you? Whoa, that's crazy. You only have a mom, but no dad? Hey, we pure people like to produce some other way. Oh, so, I don't want to say it, but I just can't believe that you don't really have a dad. Well... I love your dad like my dad, Chad. Oh, thanks, Lena. Yeah, thanks, Lena. That's so sweet of you. What, dad? Oh, hey, son. Was you doing another one of your talk shows? Yeah, we didn't expect you to do an appearance. Well, after Lena says she appreciates me being her dad, I just came in to say, Lena, even though you don't really have a dad, you just have a mom, I still appreciate you as my daughter. You heard that, Lena? Chad's dad still appreciates you as his, your, you know, his own daughter. Aw, oh, thanks, Chad's dad. Right, because you really come over to my house all the time, and you really do lots of fun stuff with my dad. That's how. Well, I don't have a dad, but I love your dad like my dad. Does that make you and Lena siblings? Uh, no, because we're not in the same family. She's in a different family. I'm in my family. Oh, I'm about to say, if you're going to share the same dad, you should be in the same family. No! I know more between siblings. Wendy Scott wants to know, Hey, Piers, will your film win a nominee's award for Best J-Book Movies and Tiver Film of 2023? I sure hope so. I mean, our sequel was really amazing. It was so much better than the first one. Right, it was so much better. I hope it wins the award for Best J-Book Movies Film of 2023. But beside that, we have other films that came out in 2023 last year, like Hubra's Return, Mega Handle 2, More Teagles, and... The boy who wouldn't leave his room? Like, I don't know what film might win. Well, it depends on whatever we announce it during, you know, the J-Book Movies event to him, exactly, because we need to know what's going to win. But I sure hope our film wins, because, ooh, we never won an award for Best Animated Film of 2022. Right, Chanko and Friends 2 took that spotlight. Hey, it was really amazing. Yes, it was. So I just hope that we win this time. Oh, I sure hope so. But we never know, Wendy. But we will see. And you will see, too. 
Carter just goes, hey, PPS, are you watching the Lakey's hair too? Yes, we did see Lakey's hair too. It was brilliant. It was lovely. So many new characters. Plus, we got all the old characters cutting hair and new songs too. Oh, the songs were amazing and beautiful. They even brought back Dance With Your Hair. Oh, they even brought back that song. And that was like the best part of the whole movie. Really? I thought the best part of the whole movie was the hair off. Oh, the hair off was the best scene when Lakey and his friends had to team up together to go against that black dude, you know, to just cut some hair. Right, they opened a new Baba shop and they had to cut all the hair for the new customers. We had some new customers along the side. Lakey's hair, too, was pretty much bigger than the first one. Right, and I think the sequel is my favorite. Right, I, I, I can't believe I'm saying this, but... I agree with Alias. I love sequels. Yeah, I love Lakey's Hair 2 the better. Right. And also, Lakey's Hair 2 is not the only film that came out this year so far. We also saw Team Gruff. Oh, I love Team Gruff. Team Gruff was pretty amazing. It was slick. Like, Taji is my favorite. I love gravy. I love me some Slifer. Mmm, Slifer is my favorite. Oh, he was so strong. Gravy and her, and her gooey powers. It was slime. Slimy powers. And Hugus... She was pretty much a good mother to them. Right, even though she was training them like they're her, you know, her sensei. Like, she's like the sensei to the gruffs. She's also like a kindly good mother to them. Right, that's one thing I love about this movie. The part about when Hugus and the others were bonding. Right, they had a good connection. They were growing connection. If you guys have seen our review, we actually did a crossover with all the other Timber Studios characters. Right, where we go to the premiere of the Team Gruff movie. I'm pretty sure you guys haven't seen it yet, but if you want to see it, it's available to watch online now. Yeah, it's a crossover video with all the other Timber Studios, including us, going to the world premiere of the movie. Right, and we had a blast seeing it. Even we met the Team Gruff themselves. We had merch, but we had t-shirts. Man, it was, oh. This is going to be my favorite moment of this year. Right. The Team Gruff movie premiere. Man, that movie was so awesome. I hope they make a sequel. They better make a sequel. They better. I hope they'll make a sequel. If they make a sequel, I'm in. All my money. Going tickets. I'm going ticket buying. I'm, I'm, I'm going ticket spending. Right. I, they, they, we need a sequel. You know what? Timber Studios, if you're going to make a Pure People's 3, can you make a Team Gruff 2? We need a sequel. Right. I want a sequel now. Happy I L J I X currently wants to know, hey alias, what would happen if you were blue? If I was blue? Oh, I don't think I want to be blue. I'm happy green. Green is all about the smell of grass. Right. And also because I'll be like Glover. Oh yeah, you'll be blue like Glover. Yeah, and besides, we already got a blue pure people in our village, which is Glover, which is still a bad character that we just can't stand still. Yet we still don't like Glover for what he did to our village. Right. The first movie. Oh man. I can't believe it's going on two years since our movie came out. Right. Our movie's about to turn two years old this year. Our movie's going to turn two years old. And it already feels like a it came out last year. No, our sequel came out last year. While our sequel, while our first movie, original movie, came out two years ago. Hey, time goes fast. Sure does. But I do not want to be blue. But thank you for asking me that. But also, if I was blue, I'd be sad. Oh, blue is a sad color. Very sad color. Don't cry, alias. Give me a hug. Um, lean up. I'm not sad right now. But if you were blue, you'll be sad. But I'm not sad. So, uh, get off me. And Bowman Serum. Any updates on the third movie? Why, yes! We do have updates on our third movie. Surprising. You guys are going to be surprised for this. You might want to sit down for this. Drum roll, please. Bum, 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 bum. It's coming next year! Surprising, huh? The Pure Peoples 3 will be releasing next year on May 9th, 2025. That's right, folks. Surprising news. During the J-Book Movies event tomb of last year, we made an announcement that we are working on a third Pure Peoples movie, and the release date is next year. We're in 2024 right now, so in 2025, which is next year, our third movie will be releasing. Finally, we're getting a third movie. Hey, we're the next Timber Studios popular franchise. Exactly. Exactly, that's why we're getting a third movie, because we're the next popular Tiffer Studios franchise. Exactly. And you said updates on our new movie? Well, we told you the release date, which is next year, May 9th of 2025. And the story? It's going to be a good story. We're actually going to be going to the human world. Yep, surprising news. We just revealed the story. We just spoiled the story. Our third movie is going to be about us going to the human village where Beanie lives. Yep. We'll try and give you a little bit of a sneak look at our new movie. 
we heard that our village is going to get destroyed by a man. Yeah, this man wants to destroy our village. Right. He lives in pure people. He lives in human village. It's a human. Spoiler alert. Our new villain is going to be a human. Yep, not a pure people like the last two pure people movies. It's going to be a human this time. He wants to destroy our village. And it's up to me, Chad, and Alias to go to the human world to go stop this guy and save our home. And along the way, we meet some new human friends alongside our best friend, Beanie. And we save our village. So that's going to be the plot for the Pure People's 3. Are you guys excited for it next year? You let us know in the comments down below because we finally have a story and the release date. And we hope you guys enjoy it because it might be even better than our last two movies. And we make a promise that this might be the biggest Pure People movie of all. Oh, yeah. Like, there's going to be so much scenes, so much stuff that the whole family can enjoy. Oh, don't worry. We got some kid-friendly stuff in there. And kind of adult humor because we need to get some ratings in. Right, for adults. So we're going to add a little bit of adult humor. Yeah, just to get some reviews in. And that's pretty much our updates on our Pure People Street movie. So let us know if you guys are excited for it. Well, everyone, that was our final comment. And remember, if you want to tell us more stuff, leave some more comments down below. And in the next video, we're going to be answering more, 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 more. Oh, man, I can't wait because I really want to get to my Yule Log warm up. <clears throat> Thanks for watching, everyone. See you guys later. Bye, y'all. Nom.